Hey folks, uh, welcome back to NC State Dendrology. In this video, we're gonna be talking about Quercus nigra, which is our water oak. I'm actually down here um, near Lake Raleigh um, in Raleigh. Um, you can see um, this is sort of a bottomland forest around here. Got sort of low lying areas. There's actually, you can hear a little bit of the dam nearby. Um, and right here, I have a water oak. So looking up, you can see it's got that typical red oak bark where it's kind of ridged and furrowed kind of coarse looking bark. Um, so in the red oak group, um, that is where we find water oak. Um, some of the leaves, not all of them, will have bristle tips on them, which can help you place it in that group. But looking at the bark, you can see that this is definitely not a white oak. It's kind of got that ridged dark bark. If we look over at the leaves, we see that they have these spatulate shaped leaves that are widest towards the tips with kind of a blunt end that seems to be wavy often with three kind of looking lobes near the ends of that leaf. And that's typical um, for our water oak leaves. We can look at a bunch of them over here as well. Like our other oaks, you're gonna see that the buds are clustered near the tips of those branches. So we do know this is oak, even though its leaves are a little bit less similar than some of our other ones. Um, these are some of the shade leaves. They're a little bit larger. Um, if we look, go towards its sun leaves over here, they can look very similar, but they tend to have a little bit more lobing and be a little bit smaller in size. Um, water oak is one of our more variable oak leaves. Um, so all these look pretty similar and very stereotypical for our water oaks, but you can see them getting a little bit more lobey, especially when the tree is very young. Um, but don't be confused. Just look for where you are and look for a few of those um, leaves. You can see some of those super lobey ones here um, on the younger branches. Um, but water oak is sort of like a bottomland tree. You'll see it planted all over um, in landscaping because people like to plant it. Um, it's a tall, straight, kind of strong looking tree. In the past, people used to plant it for pulp and paper products, but now that um, Brazil is growing a lot of eucalyptus for those kind of products, we no longer use um, our water oak for that. So yeah, that's water oak, our Quercus nigra.